Powerpack Delight um, by going to search and typing in star Paga. Paga is spelt P-A-G-G-A. -G -G so once you search it, you'll get Star Paga Light, which is free. There will be coming out with they will be coming out with a paid version that will include um, some great features, including online gameplay. So Star Paga is an action-based 3D space combat game. As a new member of the Azure Squadron, it's your task to attack and defend in a variety of space environments. Choose one of the four different spacecraft and take to the stars alongside your wingman in a series of dangerous dogfights against superior enemy numbers. So it's a, uh, it's a space, space setting and you're in a spacecraft and you're basically fighting the en enemy with lasers and mis uh, missiles. So let's get to it. So, Star Paga includes single player mode, a community mode, and options. So, let's check out the options first. We have uh, credits, which are self explanatory. We can go back and we can go to preferences. Uh, you can flip the screen, which takes you this way. But I like it better the other way, so I'm going to switch it back. We can change the music volume. And we can change the special effects line, sound effects. So I'm good with those. I'm gonna go back. And I haven't checked out the community yet, but I'm gonna go to single player first. So there's a bunch of tutorials, but I already know how to play, so I'm just gonna show you basically what this game is about. So they're gonna give you a little mission briefing. Nothing important, you don't need to know about it. Now you get to choose your spacecraft. So we have the Avenger, which is basically all around good spaceship. We have the Battlestar. It's larger but and stronger, but it's slower. Then we have the Resilient, which is smaller, but it's a lot, uh, has better defense. And the last one is the Scout, which is very, uh, very small and ca doesn't carry very much, but it's very fast and it's very easy to maneuver. So I'm going to go with the all-around great one, which is the Avenger. I'm going to continue. <clears throat> Little some tips. And the graphics on this game are pretty good. So, uh, let's see them right now. So we can control the spaceship, uh, once I start, by tilting the iPhone. I mean, uh, well, I have an iPod Touch. So here you see, we're in uh, first person mode, and we can shoot by clicking down here. And we have missiles by clicking down here, which I'm gonna wait for. We have a uh, auto lock on to uh, enemies, which are shown in red. See, I just shot a missile. And the red arrows, the red arrows on the top point to your opponents. So you have to lock on. Yeah. Okay. At first, the controls are a bit hard to get used to, but once you get used to them, it's really, really fun. So I'm just gonna shoot some missiles. the The game starts beeping once you've locked onto opponent, and it sh starts pointing at the opponent. So like that, when so you know when to shoot the missile. You have unlimited lasers, but you only have a certain set amount of uh, missiles, so I'll show you one more mission. Aggressive defense. Mission briefing. I'm going to go ahead and choose a different one this time. Choose the Battlestar. This one's bigger, but... 
slower. Zoom out a little bit so you can see me controlling the game. So, skip that. And let's lock on to an enemy. Whoa, I guess I just uh, did a full rotation. I don't know how. Oh, I'm getting shot. I'm gonna pull up. You also have to be aware of the space station, because if you crash into that, that's not good. I only have five missiles left. I'm going to try some of the lasers. And if you hold down onto the laser button or the missile button, uh, it'll automatically just keep on firing. Okay, so I've killed him. I'm going to go on to my next opponent. Shoot a missile at him. He's dead. And I have one more left. But I've just been shot down, so I failed my mission. So let's see if I can do anything with the community feature. Uh, how do I go back here? Okay, so I'm going to go back. And let's check out the community. Uh, this is just, um, you can Twitter, Facebook, and give some feedback. So I'm going to give some feedback. So remember to subscribe, rate, and comment.